the job is not really totally crazily difficult. So if you just want to cost the job, all it is is your overhead plus your labor plus your power. Whoop. That's it. So what we do is we from the overhead. Overhead is your rent, it's your electric bill, it's all those things that you have per month. You divide that all the way out and figure out what that actual cost is per hour. Labor. What is it for a month? You divide it all the way out and figure out what that cost is per hour. Right? Your part. I take my part. How many per hour? How many parts can I do in an hour? If you got a five foot oven or a twenty foot oven or a hundred foot oven or whatever, and you're figuring your processes. So how many of these can I do per hour? And let's say I can do, let's say I had $100 an hour here, which is crazily high, and I had $100 an hour here, and I can do 100 of these per hour. So I've got 100, 200, I got $2 a part to cover that. And then using the math that we did before, I can figure out how much power I've got per part. And then I can put my margin on it or whatever it is I want to do. Okay, which is typically what I'm doing with what the market will bear, because you'll find out as we go through this, we'll talk about it later, that powder coated margins tend to be fairly high. But the basics of the costing, that, that's just kind of it.